What up, randomies? This is your boy Gizmo GX, and welcome to week seven of the IBA season four, where we're taking on the Motor Stoke Motors, aka wait, aka my ass, coached by West, uh, our homeboy Weibo. Uh, anyways, we're ready. We're here. We're gonna press A button. I'm terrified of the squad. You know, every single week, everyone has legendaries after legendaries after legendaries, and I gotta deal with all that BS. Like, bruh. Wes's team is too broken. His two fastest mons are OP. Victine and Zeroa. If he doesn't bring those, I'm, I don't know what's up with that man, but he gotta bring them. Yep, told you. Two. Two memes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Predicted those. Predicted those two motherfuck. I mean, yeah. <clears throat> Yeah, we're, we're going to be a little bit censored here, but this team is too broken. All right. I could predict that Nidokin is, uh, uh, you know what? It, it is Choice Scarf. If it's not Choice Scarf, then I don't know what it is. Could be a new meta. I'm pretty much old in this whole entire G league. But here's our squad. We got Frieza, Mr. Boo, Botamo, Roshi, Vegeta, Son Goku. This is our team. And yes, we are running the Twisted Spoon on Mr. Boo. <laughs> Oh, man. So, me and Wes are going to do an interview after this, and <laughs> I don't know how I feel about that. Because there was not really much planning into this, and basing on the Pokemon that he sent out, it could really determine a lot of things. So, my guess is that he's going to go into Victini, and or it could be Zerua, though. So, I'm going to go into Sun Goku. I feel like that's a really solid option, and depending on how things go... Because I pretty much, Son Goku is my second fastest Pokemon right next to, well, it's at least my third fastest. But when it comes to no items, it's my second fastest on top of uh, our Galarian Articuno. So anyways, uh, I don't know what to go with. Let's go with Son Goku, like I said before. And also, I need some good luck. All right, Shia, who is on the screen right now, give me some luck, all right? <laughs> I need some luck, all right, against, against my boy West. Which I hope he's doing all right on his side. My boy is going to kill it in the battlefield. <laughs> My job here is to reduce every single trainer's, um, how do you call How do you call it? The ratio to the lowest as possible. Oh, Mesprit. Okay. Ah, uh, son of a. I have a feeling. I didn't predict Stealth Rocks was going to be a thing. Stealth Rocks is going to be a thing, isn't it? Ah, damn. We're wrecked, bruh. All right. We didn't bring anything for that. <laughs> oh, my God. We didn't bring anything for that. So, uh, since... Uh, mm, since we're going to be whittled down, that really sucks. But I have nothing to reduce that. <sighs> That's some BS, bruh. All right. I, I feel like... If we ever had a best shot at doing anything, I'd probably go into Mr. Boo right now. So we have Recover. And if he goes into... Actually, basing on his Pokemon, I would have to go Mr. Boo. But I don't have any Heavy Duty Boots on you. So that's a bummer. I'll, I'll go into Mr. Uh, I'll, I'll guess I'll go... I can't make up my mind. <laughs> I'll go into Vegeta. Uh, he's going to set up the Stealth Rocks. I've seen his battling style. I completely forgot about Stealth Rocks ever being a thing in this game. So... Show me the Stealth Rocks, buddy. Show me the Stealth Rocks. Yep, Stealth Rocks. All right. All right. So we're just going to stay in because why not? We're whittled down. There's nothing much we can do now. Uh, everyone is on a timer except for Reuniclus. So I'm just going to go and go for the parting shot. Uh, I guess the worst case scenario, he goes into a dark. I mean, can I see him sending it out? I could kind of see him sending out the other one. The, the fighting type Pokemon, but now Frieza is on a timer, so once it's out, it's out. So, there's not really much I can do. So, I'm just going to go for the Darkest area. I have a feeling he's going to swap into the Komomo. Oh, never mind. Okay, so now that reduces half of our squad. <laughs> oh my god. Alright, so Darkest area. let's just go for it and see what we can do. Oh my god. What? Crit? M my boy? Vegeta? Vegeta? <laughs> Damn, he gave no Fs on that match. He gave no Fs. He said, Mesper, be gone. <laughs> With a big bang attack out there. <laughs> oh, my God. This... All right, Vegeta, you know what? If we lose this match, I love you. <laughs> oh, man. 
All right, that that was clean. That was clean. If he doesn't go into Kamomo right now, I don't know what's wrong with this man. Um, I think Kamomo is the best check for your boy. I think maybe Victini. Nah, Victini. I was this close to actually running. Uh, what's it call it? Uh, earthquake. I was this close to running an earthquake, but his team is very strong, uh, very powerful, has enough initiative, especially with his two like speed tiers. He could U turn, Volt Switch, do all those shenanigans. And now that Stealth Rock is out in the field, there's not really much I can do. And I'm scared of this team having like Choice Scarf. And he could probably have Weakness Policy, but if I could dish enough damage on this team, I should be good. Hmm. Mm. Okay, so I'm just gonna stay in parting shot. Yeah, I see right like I mentioned earlier. He's gonna have initiative. I should have really parting shot right there <clears throat> Wait Don't I have Uh Wait, hold up Vegeta show them show them the guns show them the guns. All right, never mind All right, so I do have the leftovers, but that's really all I got going for me so depending on who's faster here, I might actually lose Incineroar, but does that really matter? Who's actually primary slower? I'm actually going to look that up real quick before I actually make a move. If I could grab my phone real quick. So, uh, no, no. I was watching anime. No. Uh, pre-marina. I'm pretty sure pre-marina is slower. So once that timer gets to 40, 30, I'm going to just go with my instincts. Pokey database, uh, come on, pre-marina, how, okay, I just want to know it's speed stat, so 60, okay, 30 seconds, all right, keep it an eye, uh, I don't know Incineroar, so I'm just going to look it up real quick, Incineroar, Incineroar, I, I really should have looked it up, all right, we got 14 seconds, all right, we're both the same speed, so I'm just going to go and party shot. Party shot. Let's see who's faster. All right, we did that. Vegeta, get out of here. All right. So I saw them both at speed tier, so I'm just going to go and swap out. Who are we going to swap into? I feel like the best choice right now would be... Would be Mr. Boo. So that's who I'm going to go with. So let's go, Mr. Boo. Flip churn. Okay. So that's what I was... Oh! I saw the flip churn coming. So that gives me a free switch out, but not necessarily a, a free switch out because Incineroar is really disintegrated. The switch sucks. So it's going to be whittled down. And what it, the la next turn it appears, that's his very last turn. And pretty much uh, same could be said for uh, Landorus and... Who's the other one? Uh, Frieza, which is the Articuno. So... Unfortunately, there's not really much I could do um, in terms of favors right now. Things are going bad on your boy's end. Uh, I feel like the best uh, Pokemon he can go into right now would be Victini. Uh, he could scare me off with the U-Churn. And he will scare me out because I will swap out into Incineroar if he does that. So, yeah, I saw the Victini. And honestly, let's see. Depending on his team, I really don't see... Yeah, I don't see Incineroar doing really much for me, so... Uh, I'm just gonna go ahead and let him take Vegeta. Vegeta claimed one kill in this match, and I think that's pretty good. Uh, he's gonna U-turn. Uh, show me the real turn. I really kind of wish I ran uh, Heavy Duty Boots, but Vegeta's gonna be whittled down here. So I'm just gonna stay in here. Let's see how much that U-turn is gonna do. I'm very curious. Yeah, he's, he has a lot of initiative. So... Mm-hmm. So he could go into the Pre-Marina, and if he does that... I'm fine with it. Uh, I will take the out for Incineroar. And I'm going to let him take the bait. No, nah, no, nah, nah, no bait. Okay. <laughs> uh, all right. Uh, send out the Primarina. Oh, the Needle King. Ah, uh, there's not really much I can tell. Okay. Does Fake Out work in this situation? Hmm... Okay, I swapped into it. Would Fake Out work? I think I tested it out. I think Fake Out would still work. Because it's still... This is the same turn that it was introduced. So, Fake Out should work. Yeah, Fake Out works. I want to know what item it has. 
So that's why I kind of want to stay in. So you're going to take the bullet. And I, I will, will it really matter? Will it really matter? Thunderbolt. Okay. Thunderbolt. Thunderbolt. Okay. We're going to let Sun Goku to go down here depending on what happens. So we're just going to go with the Darkest Lariat. So I'm going to let my boy go down here. Okay. Alright, so we got that chip damage. Now here is where I'm kind of debating on what this scene is. Like really hard. I know this could be really stupid. But I really wanted to stay in and see if it's Choice Scarf. If it is, then uh, I pretty much... Ah, oh, but that's kind of scary because if I lose... Uh, if I lose Son Goku, that's pretty much game for everyone else. But I still have you left, so I'm not really too nervous about that. So we're going to go ahead and to go into Son Goku, and I'm going to check if it's Choice Scarf. I'm pretty sure it is Choice Scarf, but I really want to just take the risk. And and if it's Choice Scarf, then <laughs> maybe I could scare him out. So we're going to click the Earthquake. No, 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 I'm not going to be afraid, but I just want to know if, he has, if he's really Choice Scarf. Because if he's max Tim and no item, like no choice scarf, then I'm pretty much faster than it. Unless he thinks I'm choice scarf, choice scarf. <laughs> Which I don't think so. Oh, he's not choice scarf. Oh, damn. Never mind. I didn't pack enough wallet. I didn't pack enough wallet. Lamal. Oh, okay. I didn't do some damage counts on that one. Lamal. Alright. Bye bye, Son Goku. Oh, gosh. I thought, I, okay. I may, I swear. I, maybe I did. I thought I did do calcs on that, that I killed it, but I didn't. Oh well, Son Goku is dead and there goes two Pokemon. Uh, so now what am I gonna do? He's now I know that he's not choice scarf, so what do I do? Here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go into my boy. He doesn't have he didn't bring out the Oh, uh, let's see, what what did he not bring out? He didn't bring out any of the Pokemon I'm afraid of, so my boy is free here. So I'm just gonna go ahead and go for the call mine. Uh that's it. So, uh, I, I'm kind of curious. It's probably Life Orb Shadow Ball. Yeah, okay, that scene, this thing is dead. All right, I'm just going to stay here. Do the Calm Mine. Mm. Uh, this is very... Uh. Okay. All right, so what do I... Do? Oh, I forgot the Reflect was up. Lamal. Okay, so the, if it wasn't for the Reflect, then yeah. All right. So should I let go of Mr. Boo here? Kind of have to. All right, let's just let, let him go. All right. I'm going to let my boy go. Yeah. All right. All right, so we took down three of them. Now they're all done. Oh, God. All right. So uh, the last thing that we can do, it depends on what goes here. Uh, No, not really. Not really, not really, not really, not really. Okay, I'm gonna go into the Articuno. I'm going to Frieza. I'm really doing horrible in this match, but all right, we're gonna go into you. Holy damn. Okay, what do we do here? So we'll go for the Tailwind. We're gonna go for the. Oh wait, I didn't put Shadow Ball. No, I forgot. I was I was gonna swap Shadow Ball, but all right. So we're gonna go in. Um... What do I go for? Uh, I really want to go for the Tailwind. Alright, let's go for the Calm Mine. Let's go for the Calm Mine. I kind of want to go for the Sweep here. Oh, wait, I forgot I'm Psychic. Lamel, I kind of forgot I'm Psychic. <laughs> oh my god. I forgot I was Psychic. Wait, hold up. Wait. Wait, how did I outspeed? Wait. That's actually a good... Wait, hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Oh my god, I don't think I invested speed onto this thing. What? Okay, well, alright, we're gonna do this real quick. Oh shoot. Alright, give me a sec. Oh wait, I don't want to go and swap out. Alright. So he's gonna... So I didn't invest enough speed into that. That, that. Okay, that was... Well, it didn't matter either way, so... Because I went for the Calm Mine. So we're going to go for the knockoff. 
Because I feel like he could go into anything else. No, actually, Earthquake would be the probably... Oops, wrong button. Uh, let's see. Whoops. Uh, yeah, probably Earthquake is the best bet. So, just go for the Earthquake. Alright. We didn't do our job correctly. We killed off two. Uh, okay, so there's no more Reflect. Wow, I completely forgot all about the Reflect. But at least Vegeta got in one hit. A a Vegeta got one in hit. We got two kills. We, we did some damage. We did some damage into the squad. We could have probably done a lot more damage, but I'm... Your boy was stupid here. <laughs> Alright. So, he goes into Victini. Uh, I'm pretty sure that thing is Choice Scarfed. So, I'm just going to go for the Earthquake, because... Why not, because... Alright, we're going to take down the Victini, maybe. Potentially, it could go down. Uh, unless it's Choice Scarfed as well. It could be Choice Scarfed, which I don't see why it should be Choice Scarfed. But if it is Choice Scarfed, then... Oh, oh brother. Oh, may the gods be with us. All right, we take down the Victini. It goes down. Wow. Okay, we t we took out half of the team. We took down half of the team, and uh, that's pretty amazing. All right, pretty cool, pretty cool. West, I feel like you gave that one to me, baby. I feel like you gave that to me. Uh, uh, come on, brother. You can't do that to me. You can't do that to me. You, you you if you could destroy me, you destroy me, brother. All right, no questions asked. All right, I, I wonder where my boy's gonna go. Uh, he could go into the Zero. Uh. Uh, that is debatable. If it goes in the Marie Marina, I will go into, I will go into Kun Kelder. So that way I could probably dish out a little bit more effort into there. Or probably throw in a couple more hits. Uh, cause I feel like, uh, Kun Kelder will be the only one capable of taking on hits. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Oh, Kamomo is actually the guy. Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay, Butamo. It's your time. It's time to shine. Actually, I really don't got really much left. Ugh. It's actually a bummer. All right, we're going to go into Batamo. He, he's going to drag dance. If he drag dances, this is GG's. Yeah, there's just not really much I really can do here in this situation. So, um, I'm curious why he didn't go into this sooner. Oh, Ice Punch. Oh, okay. All right. So, we're going to go for the Drain Punch. No questions asked. Just go for the Drain Punch, and hopefully we can deal some damage. Go for Dragon Hands, maybe, potentially. Hopefully Iron Fist has enough power to go ahead and demolish whatever is coming up next. It's still really scary. I Komomo is one of the best... I think it was one of the best defensive Pokemon, but it does lack an HP, so hopefully the lack of HP does power through. I mean, doesn't power through in this match. Um, that's all I can really say about it. Uh, Komomo girl, hey, hey, we... Belly drum. Belly drum. Oh. Oh. Oh, no. Oh. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. We're going to get swept here, bro. Can we get that? Come on. Come on. Come on. Drain punch. Drain punch. Come on. Come in clutch. Come in clutch. All right. All right. We, we brought mock punch. We brought mock punch. All right. Come on. Come on. Come on. Mock punch. Come in through, buddy. Come on, I need that mock punch coming in through real quick. Mock punch? Mock punch? Can we pick up the kill? Yes! Oh, it was a crit! Oh my god, Botamo! Botamo is coming in clutch out here in this beat! Botamo, chill. Botamo, chill. Botamo. Two, two kills already? Wait, actually, is it one kill or is it two? No, it's one. Okay, we got the zero coming in clutch. Here we go. We got the earthquake. What does it have? It could have air balloon, but we're going to go ahead and test it out with an earthquake. Uh, see how much that's going to do. It's really coming down to the coming down to the wire, guys. It really is. This is plasma fist. How much is this going to do? No clue. No freaking clue. Oh, no. Oh, no, 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 no. Can we not? Can we not get paralyzed, brother? All right, earthquake it is. Earthquake it is. All right, can we can we sneak it in? Can we snag it in? Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Okay. It's all a matter of priority. Matter of priority. Come on. Come on. Get in that mock punch. Get in it. Get in there, baby. Get in there. Get in there. Mock punch. Come and clutch. <laughs> I, I don't think it'll kill. I don't think it'll kill, but it's still, oh my god, you are a god, 
Holy damn, Butamo. All right, I don't think I'll be able to take up another hit for whatever this team decides to throw at me. Uh, if I was Guts, oh my god. Holy snap. All right. <laughs> I'll d I, even if I don't win, I call that a comeback. I call that a freaking comeback. We're going to go. I think it could kill me off from that range. We're going to go for the Thunder Punch. If that. Uh, it, it has to have. It, it, I, there's no way I can survive from this. Oh, Thunder Punch. Let's go. All right. Oh, that's a matter of freaking. I don't know. How much is it going to do? Okay. I really want to know my odds my odds are right, I'm gonna look it up real quick I have a chance of winning here Pokemon <laughs> all right Pokemon damage calculator all right we're gonna look it up we got time we got time I know we're we're down to the wire I might as well do damage calcs all right <laughs> Pokemon battle simulator go play let's go all right we got 30 seconds all right we're gonna go and put in our pre-marina set uh, where is the damage calcs? Ah, okay, 23 seconds. All right. No. Okay. Well, I don't know how much that's gonna do. We're gonna die from this range regardless. So we might as well go for the mock punch. I feel like that should have been the best. Okay, I feel like that should have been the best because I don't. I think I'm gonna die here. Yeah, okay, so that was the best bet I could have gone for. Okay, oh my god. Are we really coming in clutch here? That Iron Fist? I don't know how much that's going to do. I'm really actually terrified out here. Okay, so we're down to the wire. We're literally with Mr. Master Roshi. Roshi is going to do the ultimate, the ultimatum. I don't know how much defense this thing has, but depending on its bulk... Depending on this thing's bulk, it, it's down. It's it, This is it. This is it. It's either my boy dies or we live. Or either it's either we lose. Wait, give me a second. Roshi. All right, let's look it up. Pre-Marina. We're going to look it up. Pre-Marina, the best defensive Pokemon defensive. We're going to go to level 50. I'm going to look it up. It all depends on here. So I have 40 seconds. I'm going to suck it up all of it. So depending on what this thing is running, it does 47. Okay, so max defense, max HP, bold. It does from 47 to 56%. And basing on Master Roshi's stats, I am adamant, full on, choice carved. Can we pick up the dub, baby? Can we pick up the dub from here? Let's slap the earthquake. Let's see what baby got. Come on, Mr. Roshi. Show him that original Kamehameha style, baby. Hopefully, I did not misplick. Oh, you son of a... Okay. So, now my boy is rolling on earthquakes. Okay. So, he, my boy knows the strats. Okay. So, now he's really banking it on that 47 max damage. Okay, so now he's really relying on double protect to really, really clutch this. So, again, GG's, bro. I think you won this one. I'm not going to get luck until the end. Your boy fucked up. I don't believe in that. <laughs> I don't even know. He could go for the double protect, and he could get it, and that could guarantee him the, the dub. But I don't know what his stat's looking like. Is that a kill? Did he live? No, we won. Oh, my God. Oh my god, what is this match? Bro, I was destined to lose that. I was so destined to lose it. I fucked up. I fucked up so badly. I might have to censor that, but I effed up so badly. We got the power of Shia on the screen. Maybe it was because baby girl's on the screen. We clutched it. So anyways, fantastic match to my boy Wes. Oh my god. Yo, bro, you deserve this dub. Seriously, if you're watching it to the very end, brother, you deserve that dub. All right, because I have though I forgot all about the reflect. But anyways, if you guys enjoyed this video, drop down a like, smash the subscribe button if you haven't already, and hit the notifications bell to be updated for all, well, for the rest of the season.
because we, I think we had three le three weeks left. I think with that match, we messed up uh, Wes's ratio. I think we did a pretty good darn job. Goki, if you're watching this, I did you a solid, brother. I did you a solid, all right? I I'm going to destroy everyone. Yeah, you need me to destroy it, and I will try my very best. Anyways, this has been your random boy, Gizmo GX. And if you love comedy, you love gaming, you learn something new, so whether it's something stupid or not, this is the channel for you. And I'll see you guys in the next week. Who are we going, who are we going up against? I don't know. But anyways... Uh, well, whoever it is, we're gonna kick their butts, and this is your random boy, Gizmo Jax, and I'm out. Woo! -woo.